Hey, so anyway, John, a fix offense. Um, you know, uh, <laughs> my wife's got me doing some stuff here. Uh, these blocks here, you know, you've seen those Jenga, giant Jenga game blocks that people are making all over the place on, on YouTube. Well, yeah, she's got me doing that too now. So I've had to cut a bunch of these uh, two by threes, you know, that uh, measure seven and a half inches, 54. I've got a couple of boxes here. I've got to sand all those down, you know, for her because, well, she's a vice president of a union. They're the, the local, uh, what, 503 SEIU home care union, you know, she's a home care worker. Uh, anyway, and uh, that's kind of cool, you guys out there that doing the home care. Keep it up. We all need a little bit of dignity. And uh, but anyway, uh, so so the, they're going to have a giant Jenga game there, made by John at Fix Offense LLC. Uh, they're also going to have uh, yeah some dice there. I made these dice here out of these little three and a half by three and a half inch blocks. You know, sanded them down, and and I don't know if you can see those. Uh, uh, numbers in there. Oh, there's a six. Yeah, it's all like a dice. I made uh, made uh, uh, three sets of six for her, so she's got uh, you know you play ten thousand or Yahtzee, whatever. But uh, anyway, hey, <clears throat> I got a lot of sanding to do. Uh, anyway, hey, I'll show you what uh, looks like when I'm done. Maybe uh, you know. Of course, you probably don't even need to see that because you can go to somebody else's video and watch that anyway. So what difference does it really make? Uh, I'm just letting you know that my, my wife wants me to make one of those giant Jenga games for her. And so here I am getting after it. Well, that's about as good as it's going to get. 53 more of these, and I think I'll have a Jenga set. Then she'll probably want me to make a box, just like everybody else got a box out there, one of those special Jenga boxes. Then I gotta find a spot to store it all. <laughs> 1911 house on 72nd Street here in Portland, Oregon. Had no garage. Where am I gonna store this game at? It's probably gonna stack up to here, you know? Take up about that much space. <laughs> Who knows? I might just put it in a burn pile next year. You know, um, <laughs> well, if they're not stained, they might make it to the burn pile next year. But, and then, you know, I'm not saying that out of, you know, spite or hate or anything like that. I don't know. If you know what it's like for being married for over 30 years, you'd understand where I'm coming from. I got so much stuff around here, it's crazy. But anyway, that's a different story. Right now, I'm working on having 54 of these pieces hanging around for a couple of years. Who knows? I guess you can buy these at the store now, for heaven's sakes, you know? My wife's got me making one here, and because you know, we've seen it on YouTube, you know, and now <laughs> you can just go there and buy them in the stores. I mean, what, really? Anyway, so $33 for these uh, two by fours is what I spent. I've already had the sandpaper. I had this, I bought this just to make the dice before. Oh, and that's where all the sandpaper came from, it's on the dice. Those dice, I'll tell you what, that's pretty cool. Well, um, I'll be honest, I really don't know how this is gonna work out. I've got nine of these pieces uh, sanded down so far. Pretty smooth. They're pretty smooth. But uh, you know, now I'm gonna, uh, you know, maybe push one through there and kind of pushes the whole stack. Maybe I need to hold dog on uh, 54 on there first before I start making any uh, uh, sudden movements with these things. But uh, yep, uh, one step at a time for my wife. You know, I love her, so I'm gonna make these uh, 54 pieces. Uh, giant Jenga game and, uh, and I certainly hope she doesn't make me make her a box to go with it anyway <laughs> don't give me any oh, ideas oh my goodness <laughs> don't give me any ideas well I got caught now I guess I'll be making that well I'll tell you it certainly isn't as easy as it looks on everybody else's video my goodness this is just this is like taking a lot out of you know I mean I got four stacks done. That's 12 pieces. 
man. Even the sander here, that's like, you know, I, I don't understand how you guys get it done so fast. My goodness. You know, and then you make it look so good and so easy on YouTube, man. It's like, what? The? Anyway, <laughs> I'm having a good time, though, sitting out here. It's a beautiful day on the front porch, you know. I know what I'm doing it for, you know, and uh, I'm getting it done, you know. Like I said, it's not as easy as it looks on YouTube. So if you're out there and you're looking at this video here and you're thinking, that, you know, hey, I'm trying to show you how to make a Jenga game. No. <laughs> I'm trying to build one off of what you guys already showed me. <laughs> I'm doing a good job. We'll see. 54 pieces. I got about, uh, I got what, 16? No, 12 pieces right now. So, <laughs> 42 more to go. I got, uh, this makes, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, five times three. That makes 18. 18 of these bad boys. Um, they're coming along though, you know. Uh, let's see. Uh, well, you know, it, it's gonna, it might work, guys. I don't know. Look at that. It might work. Hey, at least it won't fall over as fast as the little ones do, you know what I mean? Because uh, those <laughs> little ones, you start playing with those things, they're so wobbly. I mean, you gotta be a really professional with those guys. I don't know. Now, one thing I noticed is uh, there's a lot of dust around here. And so, uh, I don't know if all these other videos tell you, but when you start sanding, if you're making these blocks, put a mask on. Not just because it's COVID, but there's a lot of dust that comes out of this stuff. I'm telling you, man. Uh, I probably should have put it on before the first 18 blocks, but uh, I took a break and I was like, blew my nose out. My goodness there was a lot of snot there brown snot anyway uh you know just being real here you know uh just put a mask on if you're gonna start sanding this stuff because uh it's not an easy task and there's a lot of dust of place especially if you're in a confined spot and you don't have any hvac you don't have all these high dollar item equipments that you see on the other youtube videos you know everybody's got these special things this and that and the other thing you know man I ain't got that. I don't have that kind of luxury. So, uh, and I'm not sure if you do either, but, uh, so I'm just letting you know, hey, put a mask on. Well, <clears throat> that makes halfway. <laughs> halfway. 27 blocks so far, guys. There's a lot of sand in here. So, uh, I don't know if, uh, yeah, it's all over me. It's all over me. I don't know if you guys are into making a Jenga game or these giant Jenga games, but uh, It's a lot to it. There's a lot to it. So, uh, you know Make sure you get the right tools. I don't know if this is the right tool or not, but I'll tell you what man, Sure makes my life a lot easier rather than sand in my hand I just could sit here and just keep it at one steady speed and and boom bam, you know and I got 27 of these so far I think I'm going to take a break. I'm going to go in and eat a donut, have a cup of coffee. Um, I don't know about you, but why don't you go ahead and take a break and, and uh, from watching this because I'm sure you're tired of watching it. Uh, <laughs> well, <clears throat> now that I have my coffee and my donut, I'm back out here uh, scrubbing away on these seven and a half inch blocks for my wife, you know, and. Uh, you know, I got, I don't know, 29. That's another one down. That's another one down. So, uh, yeah, we're getting after it. <clears throat> like I said before in the last one, last shoot, you know, before I finish this up, it's not as easy as it looks, but we're getting after it. <clears throat> so I found out last night that uh, one of my work trucks got broken into. You know, it's not like they got much you know a few batteries dewalt batteries you know because have electric tools out on the fence line but uh, what's weird is i had the money right there in the in the foreman's little thing there you know where he keeps all his files at for the jobs he does a couple hundred bucks there 
<laughs> they didn't take that. It's the batteries. Yeah, no big deal. Got batteries on the way. But you know what? It just kind of just shows you what kind of world we live in today, man. It broke my lock, you know, and it just took some batteries out of my truck. You know, it's just kind of, it's kind of just sad what the world's really coming to. I'm sure some of you guys can understand. And so, uh, I don't know what to say, but it just, just, I just came to my mind. I thought I wouldn't throw that in there while I was sanding all this stuff, you know, because I'm not showing you that I'm sanding all this stuff because you can find other videos of that. You know, I'm just here to tell you that it's not as easy as it looks, guys. Well, it's coming along. <clears throat> Getting after it. I think I got, uh, let's see, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13 stacks here, you know, plus another, you know, another one on top of that. So that's uh, a, <laughs> what a big stack there, really. What a big stack. Uh, anyway, <laughs> you know, I tell you about my truck getting broke into last night. I was out on an estimate today. <laughs> out on an estimate today. <laughs> I get done with the estimate, go to my truck, go to start my truck up, it wouldn't start. I think the fuel pump went out. But I had to have AAA come and get me, and my wife had to come and get me, because, you know, with COVID restrictions, the uh, tow truck driver wasn't going to put me in a truck. Mask or no mask, COVID or no COVID, it don't matter. Vaccinated or no vaccinated ain't getting in the truck with him so my wife had to come pick me up anyway trucks out here you know got it back from the house but uh <laughs> wow one thing after another huh <laughs> anyway <laughs> i'm getting it done it's not as easy as it looked guys well that does it got it done all uh 18 stacks of them. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. 18. That's 54. Right? 18 times 3. Yeah, 54. Anyway, hey, all done. Uh, and I just want to let you know that uh, <laughs> it wasn't as easy as possible. You know, I want to, you know, remind you guys about if you're going to get this stuff and you do it on your own, you know, instead of buying it at the store, you know, uh, you might want to look at some of this stuff before you, you know, like some of these, some of these weren't going to even be able to sand out, you know, uh, it was pretty cracked there, you know, big crack there, uh, big old crack here, you know, so I wasn't going to be able to sand that out and make it a nice block, you know, of course, then you got the knots here, you know what I mean? So, you know, anyway, just letting you know, just. A big old crack all the way down there. I wouldn't have been able to sand all that stuff up, you know. And then, and then the people playing the game, right? Think, what kind of game is this? All cracks in it and stuff like that. Uh, but anyway, homemade. This is what you get. Um, <laughs> pretty proud of myself. 54 blocks that I cut and sanded. Now my wife's gonna paint them. And she's going to have a game at the Union Labor Day picnic party. Uh, regardless, whatever. Uh, if you're going to do it on your own, it's not as easy as it looks. All right. I know these guys on YouTube, man, they make things look so easy. They fast. And I don't know how they do it. But, of course, they probably got all the right equipment, too. So um, I, I was just taking the videos and running with it. You know, and I thought, hey, why not make a video of me doing what you guys do? All right, but anyway, you know, I don't know how I did. We'll find out. We'll see what happens, you know. Uh, it works. That's, that's, I guess that's the main thing, you know, is, is it works. Uh, so anyway, John Fix a Pence um, made a Jenga game. <laughs> a giant Jenga game. Have a great day.